The director of Titanic, James Cameron, is speaking out, saying he knew an implosion was the only scenario he could come up with to account for what happened to Ocean Gate's Titan submersible. I watched over the ensuing days this whole sort of everybody running around with their hair on fire search, knowing full well that it was futile, hoping against hope that I was wrong, but knowing in my bones that I wasn't. And so it certainly wasn't a surprise today. Um, and I just feel terrible for the families that had to go through all these false hopes that kept getting dangled, you know, um, as, as it played out. On Thursday, OceanGate announced that five people on board the missing Titan lost their lives after they found debris that was likely caused by a catastrophic implosion. The Titan first entered the water on Sunday on an expedition to view the Titanic wreckage. Cameron told CNN's Anderson Cooper that he first heard news of the missing sub on Monday morning and immediately connected with his colleagues in the deep sea submergence community to learn more. But when he found out that they had simultaneously lost communication and tracking with the Titan, he says he knew implosion was the most likely scenario. In the 1990s, Cameron became a deep sea explorer while researching and filming his movie. Later in the conversation, he said he hopes a thorough investigation will take place to provide information. He added, quote, obviously, we're all kind of heartsick from the outcome of this.